Hey guys, today we're drawing the awesome life of the biggest gamer in the history who got carried by Fresh in literally every single match. We're talking about the Lord of the Yeet Squad, Laserbeam. In the failed attempt to beat PewDiePie in his valiant effort to beat Ninja in Rock, Scissors, Paper, he made Laserbeam the biggest gamer of all time. But with all seriousness, Laserbeam became one of the biggest YouTubers through his hard work. He's been through a lot and dropped out of school because he wasn't that good at studies, then tried to open a YouTube channel but all his camera and gear got stolen. Still, he never lost hope and started a gaming channel and became one of the top gamers. Currently, Laser has over 15 million subscribers. That's massive. Not only that, he's a fan favorite. In this video, we are covering the complete history of Laser, from his childhood to his massive success to his son Fresh. So, let's go right into the video. The original name of Laserbeam is Lennon Neville Econ. He was named after the famous singer Lennon from the Beatles. Laserbeam was born on December 14, 1996, which makes him 24 years old. He was born and brought up in Australia. His family is in a construction business. Laser's shown his dad and his mom in many of his fun videos. He has a sister named Tanner Econ. She's a professional photographer. She's also into gaming. Following Laserbeam, Tanner started her own YouTube channel in 2017 and she's doing well on her own. She recently joined in the Click Crew and became a member. He has two brothers also. The elder brother is named Jared Ecott, who's a professional baseball player who also manages their construction business. The second brother is Kalen Ecott, but he's never shown in Laser videos. Laserbeam's family members frequently come in his videos. His family is so supportive of him. Laserbeam is very close to his dad. He's told that his dad is the inspiration behind all of the success. His dad is so generous and hardworking that he set a great example for Laserbeam. There's one more special family member, Laserbeam's dog named Willie. He got Willie in 2017. Laserbeam was an average student in his school. After he finished his high school at the age of 15, he dropped out. Laser started working with his father in their family business. For the next few years, he was working with his dad. He really wanted to work and earn and make a name for himself. However, their family business didn't interest him much. Laserbeam wanted to do something else. He wanted to do something which he enjoys and loves to do. Laserbeam used to enjoy watching a lot of YouTube channels. As he spent more time with those videos, he thought of starting his own YouTube channel. The question was what kind of channel? After putting a lot of thought into it, Laserbeam decided to start a smashing channel using their family construction equipment. He'll break, explode, and smash random stuff and show it in slow motion. It's actually fun to watch such videos. Laserbeam used equipment from his own construction company. He bought a camera and gears with 5,000 grand that he had and started uploading videos in late 2014. It wasn't bad. Laserbeam was gaining subscribers. He almost reached 600 subscribers. He was happy and excited to do more with his channel. Then something very unfortunate happened. Laser beam shooting equipment was stolen. In January 2015, he had to put out his last video in his channel, telling that he won't be able to upload anymore because of what happened. Laser couldn't afford to buy the expensive slow camera and all the other equipments again to restart the channel. He felt so bad that he had to give up on what he started very well. His family's rich and they have money. He could have also done well if he continued in that path, but he was not passionate about that. The reason he started his YouTube channel is to fulfill his creative need and passion, and when the gear got stolen, he was heartbroken. Laserbeam was not ready to leave it there and go. He decided that he should start another channel, which requires no investment. He started thinking in those lines. That's how he got the idea of starting a gaming channel. Laserbeam used to game a lot, and he used to watch gaming channels like Machinima, but he didn't think he could start one. Now that there's no other go, Laserbeam took a leap of faith and started the channel immediately. On January 4th, 2015, he started his channel named Laserbeam. The first video was uploaded on February 15th, 2015. It was a gameplay video on Madden NFL Challenge. Laserbeam started uploading gameplay videos consistently. Mostly he did NFL and GTA videos. His channel started growing. Within six months, he had 50,000 subscribers in his channel, which is quite decent to be honest. His face was not revealed yet to the audience. With the growing success of his channel, Laserbeam did his face reveal in August 2015. 
Laserbeam was very pumped up about his channel's growth, and he worked hard. He did many different games, vlogs, funny videos, pranks, everything in his channel. He and his sister moved out to a rented apartment in 2015, where Laser could stream with great quality internet. Finally, things were looking good for him, and he was hit with another big hurdle. It was around 2016. It was the time of the pre-ad apocalypse. Everyone was using all kinds of colorful language. You can say anything you want. I mean, you remember Ninja, right? All the gamers used to trash talk and swear a lot, including Laser. So after the ad apocalypse, YouTube censored the whole website. Because of this change, almost every video in Laser's channel got demonetized. All of a sudden, Laser was making no money. So it led him to move back to his parents' house because he was not able to pay rent. It was a downtime for him, but his subscribers were growing anyway. He hit a million subscribers in mid-2017. In 2017, Laserbeam started playing Fortnite. Now hear me, this was the massive turning point in Laser's whole career. Again and again, he was hit with bad luck, but for the first time he got something good. Fortnite changed the gaming community. Laserbeam started getting 2 to 3 million views per video. His subscriber count increased exponentially. He played Fortnite through 2017 and 2018. Laserbeam became a well-known name among the Fortnite players and gaming community. When he hit 5 million subscribers, something big happened. Yes, Clickhouse happened. Clickhouse was started by Muselk for top Australian gamers, and Laserbeam was a non-negotiable presence they wanted. Laserbeam was happy to be part of this, and he moved into the Clickhouse in September 2018. This helped his channel a lot. By December 2018, he had 7 million subscribers in his channel. Along with his booming career, Laserbeam had something happening in his personal life too. In 2018, Christmas party, he met Ilsa Watkins, who's Muselk's sister. Laserbeam and Ilsa got along very well. There are a couple since then. He even introduced Ilsa to his viewers. In the click house, Laserbeam had been playing only Fortnite. He uploaded every other day and never broke the schedule. In 2019, Fortnite started losing its charm. The gaming community was saturated with Fortnite players. By mid-2019, suddenly Minecraft became a sensation. Laserbeam started playing Minecraft, and slowly he stopped playing Fortnite and only did Minecraft videos in the same schedule. Each of these videos averaged at 9 to 10 million views. That's a lot. Once again, Laser's audience stuck with him when he changed his content to Minecraft. Along with Minecraft, he played some other random games like Happy Wheels, and he did fun videos like reacting to memes, reacting to TikTok videos, or smashing 100 keyboards. You know, he was basically doing everything in the channel to make it more interesting for his audience and for him. And these videos yielding the same million number of views. When we talk about Laserbeam, we have to talk about his close association with Fresh. Of course, the friendship started with Fortnite. In 2018, when Mr. Fresh Asian actively started playing Fortnite and streaming, he played with many popular YouTubers, big names like Muselk and Lachlan, also Laserbeam. But more than anyone else, Laserbeam supported Fresh to come up with his gaming career. He uploaded many Fortnite videos in his channel Gaming with Fresh, which helped Fresh to showcase his talent to millions of viewers. This helped Fresh get a lot of traffic in his Twitch streaming. Laser always had a protective care towards Fresh. Even when Mr. Fresh started his own YouTube channel, Laserbeam was the one who came so frequently in his videos. At least 50% of Fresh's videos have Laserbeam in it. Gaming with him, also 100% of times, Fresh carry Laser in the game. At many occasions, Laserbeam is termed Fresh as his son. They have an incredible bond for sure. In 2019, even Fresh joined Clickhouse, which again made their friendship stronger. Laserbeam was actively participating in all the Clickhouse videos. By October 2019, he bought his own house and wanted to move in. Even though he didn't live anymore in Clickhouse permanently, he was being a part of everything in the house. However, the Clickhouse was not going as they thought. There were unexpected challenges in running the house. So, by December 2019, the members of Clickhouse moved out of the original mansion. They moved into a new place in February 2020, a smaller house, which is a $20 million house though. In this new house, the live-in members were Muselk, Laser's sister Tanner, Molly, Bazagaza, and Loserfruit. Other members moved out of their own places, still being technically the members. 
So Fresh moved out of the click house and guess what? He moved in with Laserbeam. Laserbeam was so happy and welcoming for Fresh. As of now, they both live in the same house. Laserbeam had a second channel which is completely inactive now. The last video in that channel was uploaded in May 2019. In his main channel, Laserbeam is uploading mixed content as always. His subscriber base is growing no matter what. It's at 15 million subscribers now. Each of his videos get an average of 10 million views. Keeping everything aside, guys, Laserbeam is a genuine guy. He's honest and real towards his audience. He likes to live his life hustling. He gives a lot of importance to his family. Laserbeam knows the value of relationships. He's also funny and lighthearted, taking everything in an easy go lucky way. Sometimes he takes a break from his videos and says that he was not doing emotionally well. He feels absolutely proud of sharing his feelings. It's a great way to look at life. Young people who watch him definitely will imbibe such qualities from him. Laserbeam has gained so many fans, not only because he's a talented gamer, he's more than that. He's a great personality. We don't know if he's going to rule the gaming community forever, but we sure know that he, as a person, is going to shine forever. So there, guys, that was the draw of my life of Laserbeam. If you love this video that I know you do for sure, hit that damn like and subscribe button and I will see your beautiful faces in the next episode. Till then, peace out.